Okay guys, welcome back to another video on the Foxtech YouTube channel. Today we're diving into a common issue reported by many iPhone users. And it is the frustration of apps not updating automatically. If you found yourself in this situation, fear not as we have some practical tips and solutions to get your apps back on track. Firstly, let's address the automatic updates feature. So you can open your settings app like this. And as you are in this section, make sure to navigate to the App Store. It's not part of the menu in the Apple ID. You need to scroll down and find the App Store right here. So go ahead and tap on that. And here you'll find an option to toggle on the automatic updates for your apps. Enabling this right here enables or it makes sure that uh, your updates seem seamlessly get installed in the background, sparing you the hassle of manual updates. Another potential method, as you are in here and as you have done that, is basically where the updates could be restricted on installing apps. For this, head over to the settings app again, so we'll come back to the main section. And in here, you need to find the screen time. So go ahead and go to the screen time like this, and then tap on content and privacy restrictions. So I'll click on here, and you just want to make sure that the entire thing is preferably turned off. So you don't have any content and privacy restrictions enabled altogether, but if you want to keep some of them enabled, make sure that the installing apps and stuff like this is always allowed. So you just want to make sure that you're not blocking anything. So allowed apps and everything, make sure that everything is running perfectly in at the background. So definitely something to pay attention to and to keep in mind. Okay, so now there are other things which could be going on because we could also talk about some classic troubleshooting step, which is restarting the iPhone. This could be also the problem as well. So you can scroll down to the uh, general section and click on the uh, shutdown button right here to restart the iPhone. Or you can also go ahead and click on the general section and just go to the software update and restart the update and make sure that you get the latest software of your iPhone installed on your device right away. So yeah, that's basically how it works. And also before we move on to the finishing of the video, before we wrap up, I want to show you the Fox Tech educational platform, which I have created recently on the school platform. You can join it for free. The link is going to be down below in the description. There are many courses you can watch, of course. So go ahead and check it out right now. It's it's going to be linked down below in the description. For now, thanks a lot for watching. See you guys later in the future.